may have been a little bit late to the iPhone revolution, but now that I have one, I don't know what I did without it. But I'm not the only one who loves my iPhone. My 10-year-old son loves it too. With more than a thousand downloadable apps for kids in the iPhone store, I know I can find something he wants to play. But there are also lots of apps with racy content geared just for adults that I don't want him stumbling across. Today, I'm going to show you how to use Apple's parental controls. On your iPhone, you can turn on and off certain features you don't want anyone to access. At the iTunes Store, you can restrict the types of content you can download. To set up the restrictions on your iPhone, touch Settings, choose General, then choose Restrictions. Here, you'll be prompted to set up a pin that gives you access to enable or disable restrictions. You can set it to not display explicit song titles. You can turn off the Safari browser to prevent surfing. You can turn off YouTube. You can turn off iTunes. You can prevent downloading apps. And you can even turn off the camera. What I like about how this works is that when you disable something, the icon just disappears from the home menu. Out of sight, out of mind. Let's say I don't want anyone taking photos with my iPhone. I just turn off the camera. When I go to the home menu, the camera icon's gone. Same with, say, YouTube. Off, then it's gone. But the iPhone only allows you to turn on and off iTunes access. To limit the types of content that you can download, sign into your iTunes store on your computer. Go to Edit in the top menu and choose Preferences. Click on the Parental Controls tab to change your settings. Keep in mind that while you can turn off the iPhone's browser, there is no safe search setting to filter results. If you don't want to turn off the browser, but you do want to restrict the websites it can find, there are apps you can download to fine-tune your browser search settings. It's so easy to set these controls. I would say the only problem is remembering which features you've turned off. But don't worry, your kids will probably remind you. For more tech tips, visit us at commonsense.org. 